How do you put these in the oven? It doesn't fit. <laughs> Now take your other one that fits the oven and put these in the oven. Now we wait. Two more. Some of these red tomatoes. Shirts Kitchen. Today we are going to be making our family's vegan cheese cow chips recipe for you. A recipe that our mum made when she couldn't find a vegan cheese cow chips recipe and she really wanted some salty vegan cheesy chips. Before we start, here is a picture of my siblings and I making vegan cheese cow chips in July 2017 on Instagram. Now let's get on with this recipe. And guess what? This recipe was made for you all, so if you don't have a dehydrator, you can also make it in your oven. And no one will be left out because this is for everybody. And also, guess what? We are going to be exact in this video. We are going to tell you a pinch of salt, salt to taste, because you know no one likes that. That's just one of the annoying parts of cooking. When they say salt to taste, we're going to tell you. Okay, it's a teaspoon or it's a tablespoon. Probably not a tablespoon. <laughs> a teaspoon. <laughs> First you need to soak your cashews for 8 hours or then overnight. But if you're in a big rush, you can soak them in warm water for 30 minutes. Make sure you cover all the cashews. But this is YouTube, so I've had some soaking already. Cut your capsicum into slices. Cut the skin off two lemons. Cut off both ends, cut it in half, cut off the sides, then slice them to find all the seeds. We wanted to buy one yellow tomato in this size, but they didn't have it, so we have 132 grams of these little tomatoes. So we chose the yellow capsicum and yellow tomatoes just to keep it a cheesy yellow. You can use red capsicum and red tomato, but we just wanted to keep it yellow. It doesn't change the taste much, but using yellow vegetables makes the sauce look more cheesy. I'm going to now cut these into quarters. Then get out your Vitamix or blender. If you don't have a blender, you can use a bar mix. Bar mix. Okay, do an American accent. Then get out your blender. <laughs> if you don't have a blender, you can use a bar mix, but it might take a little longer. So first we're gonna add in our tomatoes and lemon. but first you have to pour the water out of them. Then add the nuts. <laughs> Do we have enough? <laughs> no, we have to get the lid on. But the capsicum will go down. Yeah. So you just push it up. At this stage, it should have a light, sweet, nutty taste. Three tablespoons of salt. Five tablespoons of nutritional yeast. 
15 grams in each spoon. The cheese sauce is ready now. This should be the consistency. Here I have an escalope dehydrator tray. Grab a piece of kale that you have already previously washed and dried. Grab some vegan cheese sauce and cover the whole leaf. Nah, you can't do it with this. I'm gonna just go like this. Just use your hands and rub it in on both sides. Like this. Go for it with your hands, you can lick your fingers after. Normally people like to cut these into three to five centimeter pieces, but when mum was pregnant, she decided she wanted the whole leaf. So we've been doing that ever since. And our whole family loves it that way. Like in this Instagram post. We like to spread them out on the tray before we put them into the dehydrator. Then set it on 135. Now for those without a dehydrator, get your oven tray and some paper. Preheat your oven to 100 Celsius. And the same thing here, grab your kale, coat it in the vegan cheese sauce, put it on your baking tray and put it in the oven. Time to put these in the oven. doesn't fit. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was too small. I put it the other way. Long ways. We need another one. Put it long ways. No, it can go. Fix long it. ways. Now take your other one that fits the oven and put these in the oven. Now we wait. Hi there, it's the next day and the vegan cheese cow chips are ready. This one was done in the oven and these two have been done in the dehydrator. The oven was on the fan setting at 100 degrees Celsius for one hour to not burn the cheese. These two were in the dehydrator overnight for 14 hours. This one was done with yellow tomatoes and yellow capsicum and this one was done with red tomatoes and red capsicum. It causes the difference in color. It's your choice how you want to make the mixture. This is how crunchy the oven kale is. And this is how crunchy the dehydrator cow is. Hope you enjoyed our video. When you try it, tag us on Instagram and we'll share it in our stories. Bye. I have an escalopa dehydrator tray. <laughs> it's not, I know, it's just you gotta get it. I know, I know, I can feel it. You have to get it done. Come on, we have an hour of light left, or less. 40 minutes left. Okay, this is the one. <laughs> Sorry. This is the one. <laughs> we can't do this, we've got to... That you have already washed. Quickly. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Just quickly. Go. Sorry. One again. Sorry. <laughs> Stop no, 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 Jesse. Grab a piece of kale that you have previously washed and dried. Hello. Hello. It's actually nap time now, but we've decided that we're going to let them have some couches before they go for a sleep. Yeah. Yeah. Clear Pudgy, do you want to grab some cow chips and they'll see the two different colours? Someone's excited to get some cow chips. Here they come. You're the ones with... They're all yellow. Yeah. Yeah. The yellow wing yeah. yeah. That looks so good. Yeah, Some orange ones. Oh, 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 oh. oh.
And we know that people want theirs to be really short or small, but we've decided to really paste ours on and make them into big pieces of chips. Isn't it lovely when you get a bag of chips and you get that really big piece of chippy? Well, these, you're in a moment. Well, these are the really big pieces. Looks more yellow. Any more? Is that all of them? Not yet. Still more? more. Yeah, we want more. Dehydrator with Yay. heaps of levels. This is the one with the oven. Oh, yes, it helps. Good. Here you go. That's the oven. No! Gotta get them all. Yeah, we gotta get them all. And one more. And oh! More, still more. That's all. That's all. That's all. That's all. Soon. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, put, I'll more. film, I'll film, and you go really close to it. Turn it around. So <laughs> the it looks like a big giant tree. Yes, what is it? It looks like a tree. I'll go closer. Turn it around. Oh, it does look like a tree. Actually, you know what it looks like? Yeah. Oh. A big pile of autumn leaves. Oh, mm. yeah, it does. Yeah. Yes, we can eat them. Okay, you can have some now. I can have, I can eat this big one. Yes. I, I can eat I have a big, have a big yes, one. Yes, you can have that one. I have a big one. Oh. I have a big one. Is it nummy? Yeah. Junk food? Is it yours? Are they both yours? No! I've got one now. Is that yours? Mine. You've got two. And me too. And me too. Tastes amazing. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, no? Mm. Mm. <laughs> Dad and Jerusalem and Romeo are going to the gym again. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Children are gonna go and play at an indoor play area. Mm -hmm. 
I'm gonna do a little bit of editing. Make sure to subscribe and like and leave a comment. Oh, me, me. the notification button. <laughs> and me. Subscribe and like and give a comment. Me. Okay. What are you guys doing? Making He's a peacock. I'm <laughs> <laughs> doing it. Look at me. Are you a peacock? Such a it's bigger than Aphrodite's head. It's bigger than your head. You got it all through your teeth now. My you got green little bits in your teeth. No. Oh, no, and you do too. Oh my goodness. And I have a hole in it. Look, look through there. Wait. Whoa. Go backwards a little bit. I'll check out what he's doing. Go through one. Yeah, you love them. Lift them around so people can see them. We like ours to be chips like we, like I just said before, we like ours to be big chunks of chip. Okay, like really big. That's my hand next to it. I'll go this hand. That's my hand next to it. They're, they're really big. And I have big hands. <laughs> yes. When it's that small book. It's over an octave. Cleopatra can reach over an octave on the piano for those who understand. And me! And look at me! Look at me! No! Look at me! Oh yes! It's bigger than your hand. And this one is bigger than mine. And this one is bigger than mine. Mine? It's small. So when you make this recipe... It's a hat! When you make these on Instagram, make sure you tag us in your picture and then I'll share yeah. it in my stories. Yeah. I think mm -hmm. everyone will love making these. So we would give people probably two of these on a movie night each. Yes. Big ones, more little ones, less. So we're finished? Yes. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Bye! Bye. So yummy. Bye. Bye.